What we're seeing here is the global state of fishing. If an analyst or harbour master wishes to know the vessels operating in their area, they can view them in a list. If they wish to locate a specific vessel on screen, say by name, by MMSI, the vessel's identifier, or by flag, the system can quickly filter the list allowing easier analysis. The system can also bring up the history of a vessel and in the background can gather and visualise the alerts that occurred along that track. At some point on this journey, the vessel switched off and switched back on its AIS transponder. A notification of speed indicates that it was moving at a speed indicative of fishing. Vessels far from home often travel as part of a group. We can update the map. We can see the other vessels in the area of the same flag, each of them fishing vessels, and that they appear to be fishing in the same area. We can also show the topography of the ocean floor, which indicates the presence of seamounts and similar features. An experienced fisheries analyst can estimate the types of fish in such an area and cross-reference with the fishing licenses the vessel holds. The software has been designed to be scalable from this virtual watch room right down to an individual sitting at the end of a port in a developing nation. 